Hi, thanks for being here. This is The Hobbyist and today I just want to quickly talk about my favorite water containers when it comes to watercolor painting. Now, um, it may seem ridiculous to say that because basically when you're at home or in a studio, um, it's just you can use anything that you like to use like glass jars, uh, plastic cans, um, plastic bottles. It's really up to you but um, for me, I really struggled in picking the right container that will suit my purpose um, when I am traveling. So when I meant that my favorite go-to watercolor container is this is mostly for traveling. Um, one of these days, I'm going to uh, share a video of my watercolor travel pack, what's in the small bag. But for today, I want to share this thing, right? So this is a tiny um, water container that splits into three, still wet, Just clear them. So what I love about this is that you can use this like this one but also you can do a second wash or a third wash if you like and you can assemble it like this and carry it like that and for me I mostly use this part and this part and I put the brushes here in the middle and when I'm done, I just like throw the water and uh, wipe it with tissue and then just stack them. So it's really like very light and space saver. So I even put like the sponge here inside and just keep it in my handy dandy um, bag. So this is my favorite um, container for uh, watercolor painting outside or when I'm traveling but um, there are cases that I don't even have the space for this and my second favorite would be this one now this is actually a um, silicone uh, foldable cup so it retracts this it has a flat and more stable bottom there and this is around 270 ml there you go. So this holds a lot of water, but if I want different washes, I could use this one as well. And this, if you feel that it's not very stable, what I do is I actually just don't extend the whole thing. I just like pop it in like that. However, you know, how much water I would need. And what's good about this is that I can actually like clean the brush uh, from the ridges um, inside. And it looks big. Let's see, the diameter is about uh, 10 centimeters. This one with is 7 centimeters by 8. Thickness is three centimeters so it's really handy dandy so what I like about this one is when it's like this it's very thin okay so it didn't even reach two centimeters and it has this thing you can hang and it's just I actually have two of this um, one spare or sometimes I put my, my um, brushes there as well. And this one is for the water. And of course, if we don't want to bring this. I would bring this um, excellent water brushes of different sizes. Like even this one. I love this one. Um, so that's it. Um, this video is not sponsored. But if you want to check this things out um, there's a link in the description below thanks for watching